Welcome back to my channel. My people are see the B now. They say that um, Russia don't they lack customers. We go help and fight war in Ukraine. And because of this matter now, they don't decide. Do they recruit Nigerians within the countryside? Maybe they go fight the war for them to be able to renew their <laughs> document. Now what do they see inside Russia? So those of us that we say that they say oh Russia is Russia is doing well. Russia may be doing well in Africa, but that invasion of Ukraine, <laughs> um, for my own personal opinion, no, <laughs> I no agree. I know I, I no believe in somebody enter another person land who they drag there say my own. I no believe in that. But when it comes to Africa, maybe Russia they do well there, or Russia is doing the right thing. But the invasion of Ukraine. It will destroy Russia. And I don't know the people when they fight Russia. No, no, nah, no, no. Nah. Now, nah, push Russia, go into that war. Now, so now they praise Russia. Don't try Putin. Don't do this one. Don't do this one. Go and see how these Ukrainians now will be saying. When, when you push somebody, a nobody to the wall, that person will show you, say, in get shit, they will even show you. Go and see how small, small children are using drones now, like toy, inside Ukraine. Take the bomb Russia. Russia go, they send, uh, uh, what did they call them? They send armor tank. They send uh, troops. Meanwhile, this one sit down inside one place with a few infantry. They send drones where they go, they bomb. Buai, buai. If you they watch what they happen for, but some of them are going say, oh, you do they watch uh, all those uh, propaganda, CNN, this one, this one. In every lie, there is truth. There is a little, in every rumor, truth the inside. True today inside, if you like, believe them. So why? So, okay, so you go tell me now, say all this. May we see the details first. Russia sending Nigerians, other African students, to war for visa renewal report. Mm -hmm. I don't even, I don't even talk and see. Most of these people will be saying that they support Russia. Some of them are there for uh, Europe, they for Germany, they for America. Why not relocate to Russia? Go and stay in Russia. If you are there supporting waiting to happen for for Russia, maybe as they did invade Ukraine, then go and live in Russia. You know, go go there, but you go there some. If to say I be all these European countries, once I see say now you you day somewhere they support them, then we deport you to Russia. Say you are a supporter, may you go help her. Yeah, and so now know some of uh, on our way they support them. On no no, Russia is allegedly sending thousands of migrants and foreign students to fight alongside its troops in the war against Ukraine for some. For visa renewal, report Bloomberg. According to business news platform, the assessment was done by some European officials who alleged that the Kremlin is doing so to add extra manpower using the tactics first deployed by the Wagner Machinery Group. The report added that Russia has been threatening not to extend the visas of African students and young workers unless they agree to join the military according to officials familiar with the matter. Moscow has also been enlisting convicts from its prisons, while some Africans in Russia on work visas have been detained and forced to decide between deportation or fighting. One European official said, some, some of these people had been able to bribe officials to, say, to stay in the country and still avoid military service, said the official who, like other people cited, spoke on condition of anonymity. Oh, now they say, for inside Russia, now this one, they happen now. I don't tell people, we be say, if you know, say they support the invasion of Ukraine, go to Russia and leave. The way, way, the way when Europe take rescue mo most of the migrants from the Mediterranean Sea, if now Russia, they go rescue you like that, the way when Europe, when Italy, them, all those countries, Germany, take they give asylum. If now Russia, they go give you asylum or the rescue like that, now we check you. Russia's practice of sending migrants and students into battle under duress dates back to earlier in the war, another European official said. Those troops suffer especially high casualty rate because they are increasingly deployed in risky offensive maneuvers to protect more highly trained units, the official added. Now, what they do is to send those uh, people, we be say them be minor, people we don't know anything. 
Make them go front so that Ukraine go fire, fire, fire. They can buy them. Then their weapon go day down. Then they go now send the people will be experts. May they go fight the war properly. When I see them. So now I make uh, the West go call a meat grind uh, system when Russia take the fight inside Ukraine. Whether you believe it or not, too, but no be me now. Come the report and say Nigerians, they don't send them. May they go there, go they die like foul. A spokesperson for the Russian foreign ministry didn't respond to an email seeking comment. According to reports citing Ukrainian intelligence, Russia has engaged in a global recruitment drive to enlist foreign machineries in at least 21 countries, including several nations in Africa. Army recruitment campaigns offer lucrative signing bonuses and salaries for those who will join up as contract soldiers. Recruiters have also targeted migrants and students who previously looked for employment in Russia and in some cases have lured others over with promises of lucrative work before forcing them to train and deploy to the front. So, <laughs> you did they sign you for war. <laughs> How want they leave to enjoy the bonuses where they sign, give me. Now, what we, when we they use our eyes, they see waiting, they fall. They see bombs, they fall. They see helicopters, they deploy bombs. They see missiles. They see modern equipment with the day where they hide. They fire into where they know no. Now you won't send me go. <laughs> Oga, we no be saying in my country. Eh, uh -huh, what are they fight for? Oga, you never start to. <laughs> I never, <laughs> I never start. And like I say, eh, uh -huh, I know say I go there alive to eat those bonuses. No be the one where you go send me where I know no. I go Congo they fight. Lord, you you know the work. Russia's ability to mobilize far greater numbers of troops could become a significant factor in the war as President Vladimir Putin seeks to capitalize on a shift in momentum this year. For now, though his forces have been grinding forward only slowly in northeastern Ukraine and suffering heavy losses despite a shortage of troops and ammunition on the Ukrainian side, now, the reason why the Russians are suffering huge number of losses is because the Ukrainians have adopted a very dangerous tactics of using drones. So when they do, they do Russia, sort of, Russia have to go and buy all those total uh, uh, armor tanks. <laughs> they have to construct uh, defenses on armor tanks. <laughs> you see these Western countries, eh? You see Ukraine, when I know be better people. Ukraine, when I know good. Eh? They do something, they do put in something, something, routine, go to construct, total. <laughs> I don't feel laugh. Oh. Now, the Russian military lost more than 1,200 people in a day during May, according to the UK Ministry of Defense. Its highest casualty risk of the war since the beginning of the invasion. Russia has seen some 500,000 personnel killed or wounded, the UK estimates. Bloomberg is unable to independently verify these figures. Okay? So, now, so it be now inside Russia, and waiting that they tell us, but whether you believe it or not, ask people with the inside Russia. If you have a family, check up on them, check how they are doing. May they go, may they not go enter war, where they don't know when they start. I don't know what they put in the fine side. Other people land. Crimea, when it takes since 2014, that one no do them. You want to go take more land. I say, if they see waiting, go, when they go fire times one million, may they fire you there for going to inside the, another person's land. But if me, I see, say, another person enter inside Russian territory to claim, say, not their place, I go tell Putin, may fire this in nuclear weapon for them. I don't get problem. But this way, enter inside Ukraine. No, I no grief. I tall, I no grief. Forget waiting the they talk, whether they want to uh, carry Ukraine, join them. Now, now they are choice. Now they are choice. People have choice. I want to belong to the West. Good luck. Go and belong. Then you day your day there. It's because Putin is a, a waiting they call him detector. You know, one calm down. Anyways, on the other hand, they say that um, uh, they don't send the um, people we go reconstruct that uh, second uh, uh, Niger bridge. When a uh, thief go destroy the other day, uh, this our brother where they call Luxeus. Now he come out, can't tell us, say, they don't they repair the place. Make gonna watch the video.
family. We are here in Alam. Federal government have a fair on it. So my special regard to them for mine. As you respond immediately, I call you. It's a joyful thing to me. Because people say that I should be speaking English, that not everyone understands you. That's why I'm putting it to English, so that some people will understand it. Hello, Ebidoko, when you see, you talk. Because if you see and you ignore it, it may happen to you. So those who are vandalizing this state, you are not doing federal government. You are doing us. Okay, think, think that, imagine that no one raise alarm. If a man or they could ever, you have committed, you have, you go many, you have killed many souls. How, how can you be stealing the age for that bridge? So that people will have as them because of money. Is that good? It's not good. So my special regard to everyone. My special regard to them for my for fast response. People go deal with what I go. So I'm going in our bucket. You follow the other road. But can I know alone at this road? I'm going in one road to be able to get in the back. Can I call my minister of work? Can I call my minister of work? Can I call my minister of work? I think you have Okay. All right, I'm on. I don't see. I'm so they don't repair that uh, particular road now. Um, when bad belly people go spoil, uh, say they want they want go thief with it. They take the uh, divide bridge. They want go tifa. Now they don't. Uh, thank you to the government. We go respond very quickly. If not, hmm, if already do many people for don't go from that place. So that's a nice one. There we are happy about that development. So maybe we'll go straight to another news. But if you want some money, go Nigeria. Maybe you use Tap Tap Send and a beta app. When you go use, we go give you better value for your money and use my promo code with the call Critics News for the bonus. We then go give you. I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye bye.